Welcome to Schriever Space Force Base, the backbone of all U.S. space operations. But before I show you behind the scenes into that base, we need to talk about who this base is named after because he's one of the most important people in the history of our space program. His name is General Bernard Schriever. So after World War II, the Soviet Union started developing ICBMs or Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles. This just means that they can fly through space to hit targets on the other side of the world, which at that time was an entirely new capability and terrifying. In order to deter the Soviet Union from using these and thus prevent a nuclear war, the United States needed to develop its own competing capabilities, which General Schriever oversaw. You can basically think of him as the father of the U.S. Space Force. Now, back then, did he think that the U.S. Space Force would be so important that it's its own branch now? No, probably not. But he laid the foundation for all of it. He also directed the tens of thousands of DoD personnel who supported the Mercury, Gemini, and Apollo missions. And he helped create the first weather, warning, reconnaissance, and communication satellites. This is actually from the first spy satellite, and that's General Schriever. Not enough people talk about General Schriever, but what he did like 70 years ago is so important to pretty much everything that we have today, from GPS to weather forecasting, and so much more. In an upcoming video, I'm gonna show you some rare behind the scenes footage into Schriever Space Force Space, what they do there, why it's important, so stay tuned and follow along. And in the meantime, if you're interested in learning more about any of this, head to spaceforce.com.